بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم. Right, I woke up late and missed sahur. Can I still fast? Okay, that's <laughs> good. Uh, obviously, I was going to say we're still reading from Ma'ad's diary, but when he said, can I still fast and sounded eager, obviously can't be his diary. So, <laughs> so can I still fast? Of course you can still fast. Okay. Now, the thing, the interesting thing here is uh, there is a hadith that man lam yujmi' is siyam. That, um, and there's another riwayat, man lam yubayit is siyam as well, that whosoever doesn't, have I mean what it's talking about is having the intention or the certainty of fast at night um, or in the wording قبل الفجر فلا سيامله whosoever does not do that before dawn has no fast okay so somebody could ask well you know based on that since the person woke up late and the hadith says من لم يجمع السيام قبل الفجر and you you were obviously knocked out. So, how can you have a fast? Because the hadith says, فَلَا سِيَامَ Well, the interesting thing is, first of all, Imam Malik understood this to be that the whole of Ramadan is like one act of ibadah. Okay. <laughs> right, so it's one act of ibadah. Now, so knowing when Ramadan has approached you and you are embarking upon Ramadan, you know that I will be fasting for this month. So that niya tujzi wa takfi, it's sufficient, okay? It's enough to have that niya uh, and that will carry you through the entire month. So even if you were asleep, because you know this is the month of Ramadan, so you had that intention. Okay, you overslept by accident. But that does not violate your, your fast. So the fast is absolutely fine, inshallah. Um, that, so, so that, inshallah. And that, what, that opinion was taken up by other ulama as well. It wasn't just uh, Imam Malik. Some, there were some Hanabila, some other people as well that did take up that. Answer. But Imam Malik and his madhab is very clear on that point. So, as all the other madhabs are fine with it as well, but just to show this, this, this hadith of man lam yubayyit al siyam is something to do with the entire Ramadan. It doesn't have to be something on every individual, uh, individual night. So, the hadith, I, uh, as I did mention, the man lam yujmi al siyam or man lam yubayyit al siyam, whosoever, as I did translate already, I believe, that whosoever doesn't have the intention the wholehearted certainty of fasting qabla al-fajr, before fajr, then they have no fast. So somebody could say that that's a contradiction that you slept through so you didn't have that intention. But your intention for the whole month when you embarked upon it is sufficient. Okay. All right. <clears throat> Next question. <clears throat> 